Clad in white hazmat suits and face masks, federal drug teams removing boxes of evidence from a nondescript two family home on Beaumont Avenue in the Bronx. This is ridiculous. This needs to stop. Federal law enforcement sources tell PIX11 News a suspected fentanyl pill mill was being orchestrated next door to a daycare. There's a lot of kids on this block, and there's, a, there's a, like a head start right here, you know, right next to where they, they're, they're doing their thing at. So I'm happy. Get them all. Four people were taken into custody. They were about maybe in their early 20s. There was four of them, and they were Dominicans. The late afternoon raid spearheaded by the Drug Enforcement Administration and Homeland Security. You see them storming in like stormtroopers. This girl and her family were evacuated from their apartment upstairs. I thought that was suspicious also because there was a lot of packages being delivered every single week. It's the third fentanyl raid in recent weeks in the Bronx, known as a hub for pushing the deadly poison. Since 2019, the overdose rate has more than doubled in the Bronx. Children and babies are now falling victim too. Just earlier in the day, the trio accused of running a daycare drug den, killing a one-year-old, were back in a Bronx courtroom. It's just a shame that we can't live the way we should live because of the people who want to go around selling drugs and endangering the children, the young children.